So Disney has a new reservation system. The way it works is I buy a ticket and then I also make a reservation. Because after spending $400 on a Disney ticket, they're not sure that I'm going to show up. They need reassurance. <laughs> because I might just be in the mood to blow $400. It's like Disney. <laughs> Stop being so insecure. Last month, I left a car dealership with a Honda for less money down. Oh, but I still have so many questions. So many questions. Is there a point at which I will not only need a reservation for my park ticket, but I will need a reservation for my reservation for my park ticket. What would they even call that? That you know they'd have to come up with something. Because a reservation for a reservation sounds almost as stupid as a reservation for a park ticket. <laughs> Maybe they would call it an advance booking of a reservation for your park ticket. I'm worried. I'm worried that when my kids try to book Disney for their kids, they are just going to have to make repeated reservations for weeks before their trip and just hope they get in the park. Like instead of the $400 buying an actual day in the park, it buys you the chance to get in the park. <laughs> if, if that happens, the, the rate of homicides in Orlando is going to go through the roof. You're not going to have to worry about, you know, somebody sketchy on the street. You're going to have to worry about the mom with the Mickey ears. That's the real thug. Um, seriously. Disney. How often do people stand you up? I mean, I want to know. Specifically, I want to know who these people are. I'm not judging. I would just like to know what life choices they are making that get them to the point that they are so That they get up on the morning of their Disney trip and just blow it off. All right, guys. Thanks for your time. Uh, hopefully, we'll get to go to Disney this time. Last time didn't work out so well. But, uh, yeah. There's a great big beautiful tomorrow shining at the end of every day. That's the stupid Tomorrowland theme song that I had to listen to repeatedly for the last two hours while calling customer service at Disney. <laughs> because if the reservation system doesn't make you crazy, the whole music will finish you off. <laughs>